And straight ahead at six, Sam, a new step forward in the plans to turn an old amusement park into a city developed public green space. That's not all. The city of Cleveland and its police department are named in this lawsuit, claiming compensation for a wrongful imprisonment. We'll break down that story coming up new at six. New at six, multiple shootings here in East Cleveland on Labor Day. What police are now saying about these investigations. Tiffany and I are right back. We've got those stories, some updated stories straight ahead for you. All at six. Uncovering new information on breaking news and the biggest stories. 19 News New at 6 starts now. For the first time, East Cleveland police asking for the public's help, sharing pictures of the people they believe might be responsible for a string of shootings over Labor Day weekend. Thank you so much for joining us at 6 o'clock. I'm Tiffany Tucker. And I'm Brian Duffy. Now, we know one man was killed. Several others were injured over a weekend of really senseless violence. 19 News reporter Brittany Weir has the newest information from East Cleveland Police. Welcome back. It is beautiful outside. Isn't it? Another day. I mean, we'll long for this in a, a couple of months, so let's soak it oh, up. Next week. Gosh. Weather looks great through the weekend, I know. Ignore Tuesday of next week, but we do need the rain. I mean, we really have hardly seen any this month. But the weekend looks gorgeous. Fall begins on Sunday, and I think uh, the Browns game weather looks good for that. So we can cut my weather time at 10 and 11 down to like one minute. Yeah. So get it all in. I got nothing to say. We all have nice. plenty to say down the road. Don't yeah. you worry. Enjoy well, this little break. We'd like our time back in October, November. Right. Yeah. It's been gorgeous. Boy, I mean, mm -hmm. it's just, I, I don't remember a stretch this long. Of yeah. 10 days straight. Gorgeous. Soak it all in. Enjoy it now as we leave you with a beautiful picture, I believe, of the what? Hey. Oh, look at that. Have a good one. Closed captioning on 19 News, sponsored by Wayside and Akron, keeping it local since 1937.